What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. Um, today's video is going to be of my new car. And as you can see it is snowing, well it snowed, we just got a snowstorm. Um, this is a 2005 Cobalt SS. Yeah, sorry about the inside, it's a little messy. Um, my drink and all the stuff that I've brought in here. Um, it's a nice car though. I need to put this radio in, that's what I'm about to do right now. And then, it'll be looking pretty decent in the interior. The only bad thing about the interior is, I mean, the radio. The steering wheel's a little messed up, and then this driver's seat is... This driver's seat's pretty ripped. But, it's gonna be a little work in progress daily type but I don't know I like the cobalt I've always wanted one but never really had the motive to get one I guess but it's now since I've owned one for about I don't know I've had this car for about a month or two now and it's doing me good it needs some work here and there but other than that it's a pretty decent car sunroof works it does have a front bumper i just took it off because when i loaded it up on the trailer i smashed it and i smashed the radiator and heat exchanger so i had to get all new of that which i did but i just haven't put the bumper back on yet the lights need cleaned up they're a little foggy wheels have a little curb rash but it's nothing bad it can be cleaned up um they drag xx oh, i forget what they're called something drag wheels but they are 18s it does have rocker rust um not bad on the side really the only bad rest on it. Underneath is pretty clean. There's a little spot there. This thing needs put back up. A little scrape on the side. Right here and then this door is a little dented in. But you can see it's only right here. This spot. So I can probably just hammer that out. Not a bad car. Some clear coat and yeah, surface dressing. Yep, I'm probably gonna start messing with this thing and putting this radio in. I don't know, I might make that a video because they uh, they did something crazy. I guess the dude that had it before me said they put the radio in and then I mean they had a system in here and then the car wouldn't start or it was doing crazy stuff which I mean they probably wired it wrong which it looks like they did because they wired it right into this harness they didn't buy the adapter so all I have to do is I'm gonna rewire these to make sure because they just taped them on but I'm gonna make those all good and solid connections and then I'm just gonna wire this on and then all I have to do is match colors to the radio 
And then I got a dash piece too, so I can, I'm gonna put that in. And then I also have subs, which I'm gonna make another video wiring those up. And you know, I'll get nothing crazy. I'm not going all out like my recent builds with subs and like the focus and stuff. I just have two Walmart 12s that I got from my buddy. Um, stay tuned for more videos of this thing. Uh, I'm gonna make some in-depth, like what's all done to it and stuff. I'm gonna clean it up, get it all nice. There's just gonna be a whole bunch of videos, so stay on the lookout. Um, I appreciate all you guys for watching the videos and subscribing. So, yep, have a good day and see you guys in the next video.